I'm a businesswoman and I know that ethical trading can yield big profits. That's how I made my money. When things are going right at work and in business, this is how I feel. What I am, honestly, is an entrepreneur. I get very excited about coming up with concepts. Mother of two, Deirdre Bounds, has made a fortune of 16 million pounds. I had a midlife crisis and I thought, I've got to get out of Britain. So I left, taught English around the world, came back four and a half years later, and that's when I decided I can't work for anybody else. I'm going to try and do something myself. Tonight on Dispatches, we go undercover to reveal the dirty truth about where your gold jewellery comes from. And I show you how to help stop this situation. My main concern is that if travellers don't arrive in this village soon, the, the villagers are not going to believe in the concept. Jimba. Do you know anybody who's been injured whilst they've been working in the mine? People don't want to buy gold that's mined like that. I'm a real hard bitch. I can't believe I'm feeling like this. You win some and you lose some, but if you win more than what you lose, you're in business. As a business proposition, fair trade and 100% recycled gold jewellery sound great. You've got to get that hole bigger. If you had a huge curry, there's no way you could aim. Tell me, how much is this bar worth at current gold values? This is 100,000 euros. No. no. They're perfectly aware of the problems surrounding dirty gold, but as a company, they plan to charge a premium for an alternative that could help change this. Recruitment is very, very challenging. So are we saying that major high street jewellery retailers in the UK have very poorly trained staff? It looks pretty grim. I feel very, very lucky yeah. to have what I have. A lovely husband, lovely couple of children, Couple of great businesses, stack of cash in the bank. Good for you. Thank you very much for speaking Thank to you, us David. today. Thank Thanks. you.